Joel Adams, Wizard World, Fort Lauderdale. Joel, did some of the incredible work, and I had to come back and ask it. Tell me a little bit about the people, the women here that you uh, just right, well, created this is, magically. This is, uh, Emily Clark from uh, from Game of Thrones, the Near East Targaryen. Look at the detail too on this work; it's incredible. Here we go. And this is Ksenia Solo from uh, the show Lost Girl, uh, playing a character called Kenzie. And I can see all the detail on the fishnet and the buckles. Yeah, this, this is the one I went crazy on. I had uh, just I wanted to do the detail. And then we've got uh, this is Betty Page. She's a uh, she's a uh, uh, pinup model from the 1940s, I think. And then there's someone that I know, and a lot of the sports entertainment, wrestling, WWE fans will know as Paige. Yes, that's uh, that's my Paige. That's incredible. And let tell me your backstory on Paige. Oh, I uh, I uh, I did I did the piece. I really wanted to do the piece. Very hard character to draw. I didn't really get her features without overdoing it. And uh, I did the piece. Brought it to a show. Got her to sign one. And she's like. <laughs> so, so I gave her, so she, 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 got a, she got a bunch of them. That's just amazing and all, and you just tell the detail. About how long did it take you to do the page artwork? Page is probably about a day and a half on the hair and then a day on her body and costume. When you're doing something like that, do you have some type of inspiration or something that you want to get out of the piece? Well, I'll have the things, I'll have the things in the piece that I really want to focus attention on drawing. Like, like a lot of the stuff I do, I tend to draw hair and really get into the movement of the hair and, you know, the, the, the modeling of the hair. So I'll, when I look for reference to work from, that's the first thing I look for. Can I get good hair out of it? Uh, and then it's, you know, can I find a decent, I mean, they can't do this stuff without reference. You don't do, you know, any artist, if, if an artist tells you they do this out of their head, they're, they're lying to you. So I, you have to have a good piece of reference to work from. So if I can find a good piece of reference that has everything that I need to what I think would be a good piece of art, that's, that's where I start. And I'm just going back on to the artwork again, because you mentioned the hair, and you could tell the detail, and just yeah. an incredible job, and the time you spend. There's got to be something in it that I'm, that I'm looking for in the line. It's, it's the hair, it's the eyes, it's the, like the outfit she wears. Faces, faces can be a dime a dozen. <laughs> but in this case, they're not. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you so much again, Joel. Yep.